Sometimes sheriff's deputies are taking personally military markers stolen from veterans' graves, all in hopes of making a quick buck. This happened last week at a cemetery in Houstisford in Dodge County. NBC 15's Chris Woodard has our report. Here in Houstisford, families are upset, veterans are angry, and you can hardly blame them because at the grave sites of so many veterans like this one, where there is supposed to be a veteran's marker, there's nothing but a broken flag lying on the ground because those markers have been stolen. Right. I'm hoping it's, it's an investigation hitting home for police. That's all we can hope for. Today, taking pictures at grave sites, gathering as much evidence as possible. I have veterans driving in patrol cars every day in this county. And I'll tell you, to us veterans, this is this is personal. On the 4th of July, reports started coming in. Broken flags and missing markers. In all, more than 30 military grave markers have been stolen from veterans' grave sites. It's a lot of frustration. Randy Nails is a veteran himself and member of the Houstisford American Legion. When the markers went missing, he got the calls and walked the cemetery to see how many had been stolen. It's a crime he still and it was just like, oh, come on, doesn't understand. These are people who gave you the freedom to uh, be able to live as you do and, you know, to, to steal something from them, you know, that, that's just not called for. The sheriff says the brass markers were likely stolen by someone looking to make money by selling them as scrap metal. It's pathetic if it happens, it's disturbing. But it's a crime the sheriff says has become more common because recycling centers are paying more for brass. To me as a veteran, I, I think it's appalling. We're gonna be aggressively pursuing them. While the veterans still don't understand why anyone would do something like this, they say more than anything, they just want these markers back. They want the people who took them to turn them over and they want anyone who knows who those thieves might be to contact police. In Houstisford, I'm Chris Woodard for NBC 15. Chris, thanks. Deputies will be stepping up patrols in cemeteries. Legion members want anyone who realizes a marker is missing from one of their relatives' graves to report it to them so they can get a better idea exactly how many were stolen.